Hello, I'm Ms. Bonga. Today I'm going to introduce you the class about food and health. So we are going to see the interaction between food and health during this class. So uh, we have two notions. We have food and health. But today we are going to start, first of all, with food, an approach to the concept of food. So. We come here to the first activity, activity one. Among the following things, underline, you are going to underline what we cannot eat or drink. Trees, cows, some fruits from trees, bowls, vegetables, mushrooms, Sandals, acid, water, gasoline, carpillas, fish, soda, poultry, cereal, milk, alcoholic beverages, gate, meat, nut, bread, milk products, sweets, crackers, juice, wine, Rice, house, cockroach, tart, pastries. So in this first activity, what you are going to do exactly, it is to underline what we cannot eat or drink. So in the first word, we have cars. Can we eat or drink trees? No. So we underline trees. The second word is cars. Can we eat or drink cars? Can we? No. We cannot eat nor drink cars. The next one is some fruits from trees. Can we eat some fruit from Trees, yes or no? Some fruits. Can we eat? Or oh, we cannot. There are also some fruit from trees that we cannot eat. Some fruits are poisonous. So we have bowls. Can we eat bowls? Here exactly it is bowls. Maybe it is a football Bowls, football bowls or basket bowls, I don't know exactly, but I think that bowls, it's better to underline. This one, we cannot eat bowls. Oh, yes, we cannot eat, suppose. So we come to the vegetable, you know, vegetable. What is vegetable? What is vegetable? Vegetables? What about vegetables? You know, every day at home, we eat vegetable, so we cannot underline this word. The next one is mushrooms. What is mushrooms? Uh, the mushrooms, we find it mainly in forest. In Brazil, it's difficult to find it because to find the forest, you have to go far. But we found mushrooms in the forest, precisely. Uh, can we eat or we cannot eat? Can we eat or we cannot eat? What is your answer? No, we can eat mushroom. So we come to the next one is sandals. Sandals are what you wear every day. Uh, instead of wearing uh, shoes, 
like uh, baskets or any others, I don't know. But most of us, when we go to the shower, we always wear sandals. So sandals, we cannot eat them. The next one is acid. Acid, can you eat or you cannot? We cannot eat acid because it's very poisonous. If you eat acid, then you will die. So we cannot drink. We cannot drink, excuse me, we cannot drink acid. What about water? Water is something we can drink. What about gasoline? The gas gasoline is the one we use for uh, cars, vehicles, and so on. So we cannot drink it. We cannot drink it. We cannot drink it because it's poisonous also. Caterpillars. The caterpillars, you know the caterpillar? Caterpillar. But you know this word very well. Sometimes you can see the vehicle, we call it caterpillar. But caterpillar means something. It inspired the engineer to make a vehicle that can go at any place. So caterpillar, it is here, caterpillar is not the vehicle, but this is an insect. Caterpillar is something we, cannot, we can eat. There are some tribes who can eat caterpillars. It depends. So here, I think that's better not to underline. We we'll go to fish. Everyone knows the fish. We found it into the water. Uh, we cannot end, uh, underline. Soda. Soda is something you drink. We cannot underline it because the class is about something what we cannot eat or drink. Power tree. The power tree. What is the power tree? What is the power tree? The power tree is something we eat. It is a meat, but it is not like the other meat. We found it, we can give an example. We have the hen. We have also chicken is uh, what we eat. It's part of the power tree. So here we cannot eat it. The next one is cereal, cereals, cereals. Uh, we cannot, uh, we can eat also, milk we can drink. Alcoholic beverages, alcoholic beverages, yes, we can drink it, we cannot end the line. We come to the gate, what is the gate? Your compound at home, it is surrounded by a wall, but what protect your compound, it is the gate, the gate. You can open, you can close, you can lock it. We call it a gate. So the gate, we cannot eat it. So let's end line gate. The meat is something we eat every day. It can be, <coughs> I don't know, it can be a chicken meat. It can be any meat. So the meat, we can eat it. No need to end line. The nut, also we eat it every day. We can take the example of the peanut. The peanut, what we eat. So we cannot end the line. The bread, it is our everyday use. Every day we take our breakfast with the bread or the dinner, it depends. So here we cannot also uh, end the line. Uh, milk product, the milk product. What is milk product? What derived from milk? In milk product, it's not only milk. What is made of milk? We can find the cheese. The cheese is made of milk. We can find also the yogurt. The yogurt is made of uh, milk. It is something we eat, we drink. Something we drink, so we cannot end the line. The sweet. You know sweet very well. Young people like it, very sweet. We cannot, we have crackers. We have crackers, we have juice, the juice, the wine, the rice, we eat rice, the house. Okay, we end on the house, we cannot consume, we cannot eat or drink the house. The next one is 
cockroach. The cockroach, we found it in the house. If the house is dirty, in dirty areas, they develop, they, are, they, develop, they live in dirty areas. So the cockroach is something we cannot eat because it is an insect which is very dirty. We have the toad. What is the toad? The toad mainly live in water, but dirty water in some area. The toad, the one you call in French, crapo, we cannot eat it. I don't know whether, maybe some tribes, I don't know, but I better say that we cannot eat it. Pastries is something we eat every day. So, with all, we have underlined here what I ask you just to write what we can eat, drink here. Because the first exercise was about what we cannot eat or drink. So the next one, this one, this activity will be about what can we eat and drink. So from these words, we can take the first one. Here, we start with trees, cows, already in the line, vegetable. Vegetable, we consume vegetable, we can write it here. Vegetables is something we can eat. This one, we can eat. Mushroom, as I told you, we can eat mushroom as well. Mush. Rooms, sandal, acid, water. We can drink every day. We cannot live without drinking water, you know, very well. So water is the most important thing in life. Water. Water. The next one, gasoline, no. Caterpillars, we say that in some tribes, People consume caterpillars. We can also write it here. Caterpillars. Caterpillars. Comma. Fish. Always, always. My favorite food is fish. I like it. Fish. Fish. After fish, what else? We have caterpillars already. Fish. We have soda. Soda is a sort of drink. Sort of drink, but uh, it contains a lot of gays. You know. So, soda. We can drink soda. Soda. Power tree. Power tree. Come on. The next one, cereal. In this family, cereal. We consume the cereal. Cereal, excuse me. Sorry. Cereals. Cereals. Come on. The next one, after here, power tree, cereal. Do we drink milk? Do you drink milk? Yes, of course. Every day we drink milk. So we write milk. Milk. The next one is alcoholic beverage. Alcoholic beverage in our countries, you know, a lot of brands. I can cite, if you want, I can quote, like uh, Primus, like Ngok, and so on and so forth. We call it alcoholic beverage, something you can drink. So we take alcoholic, alcoholic, Beverages. Yes. After that, we have already milk, alcoholic beverage, gate, no, we can eat meat. I don't know your favorite meat. What is your favorite meat? Or uh, cereal, milk. We have alcoholic beverages. So, we have already cereal, milk, Alcoholic beverages, meat, 
we can eat milk. What else? What else? We have nuts. As I told you, peanut, it is also called ground nut. Yes, we eat it. Nuts. Nuts. After nuts, we have the bread. No need to explain you. Every day, in the morning, you take your breakfast with the bread. You take your meal with the bread and the dinner with the bread. So no need to explain. It's everyday use product. Bread. What else? What else? We already took nut, bread. The next one is milk product. Milk product. Product. Milk product. Already. And the next one will be sweets. Sweets. Sweet. After sweet, what else? Tell me. After sweet, sweet, what else? Crackers. 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 Come on. Go right. Let's go quickly. We have juice. We have wine. Rice. Rice, and we finish with pastries. So, pastries, 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 and so on. This was about the first activity that was about <coughs> among these following uh, things underlined. We have already underlined, and here. We did the last exercise. Now we'll go to the second activity. Activity two, what is about? Activity two. Activity, activity two. What is it about? So, the activity two, it is say, fill in the blanks Fill in the blank, sorry, for space, let me come back, fill in the blanks, in the blanks, with the words, with, let me give you those words, you have drink, drink, you have a drink, healthy, healthy, healthy. The next one is eat. Let me come on, come down to the line. Eat, eat, what else? Anything. The last one is anything. So, it's up to you. Let me give you some words. Food. Food. Food is. Don't imagine, but give the answer. Is living. Living. Living creatures. Can, 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 I don't know, you are going to give the answer, or, I don't know, to be, to be, to be, the answer, and, and, live Longer, live longer. It's up to you. You are going to fill these blanks with this word. You have drink, healthy, eat, anything. So, food is living creatures 
can or I'm not going to give you an answer, it's up to you. To be and live longer. What about the first words? That can cop with this first line. <clears throat> According to you, what should we write here? We have here, we have drink, healthy, eat, anything. Food is what? It's up to you. Food is what? Food is, okay, anything, 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 living creatures can, can do what? Living creature can, here, can eat. Can eat, we take eat, or can eat or can eat or drink, yes, or drink to be the last word is healthy. To be to be healthy. To be healthy and live longer. So, the activity two was about blank filling, filling the blanks with drink, healthy, eat, anything. I think it's very easy because you have just four words to fill in the blanks. So, thanks very much. Let's read together. Food is anything living creatures can eat or drink to be healthy and live longer. This is like definition of food. So here, thank you very much, you gave the definition of our lesson. That was the approach concept about food. So the definition is here. Thank you very much. Now we are going to, to deal with the third activity. The third activity, the third activity will be this one, activity three. Activity three, let me write. Activity three. Activity three. Activity three. Activity three. So here we have also another exercise. We have another exercise. about identifying 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 the substances 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 with nutrient nutrients we get from, we get from, from different, from different, from different, different food, different food. So it is asked, tick in the appropriate, tick in the appropriate, appropriate, the appropriate box. Let me draw, excuse me, like this, like that. So here, the first one would be about food, food. And like this, here we got this one, 
One, one, two, three, four, five. One, one, two. Yes, we have here, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So this activity is identifying the substance nutrient we get from different food. We are going to tick, just to tick in the appropriate box. How many box? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The last one is here. Yes. And we start with vegetables. 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 The next one is fruits. Fruits. After fruits, we have meat. Meat. Fish. Fish. Rice and cereals. Here, I don't know if you can get the space. Rice and cereals. Yes. Rice and cereal. Nut. Nuts. We have nuts. After night, milk and milk product. Very long. Milk and milk product. Product. Okay, good. Milk product. The last one is caterpillars. The last one is caterpillars. Last one is caterpillars. So in this exercise, it is said <laughs> identifying the substances, it nutrient, we get from different food. So the food you have here, you have vegetable, fruits, meat, fish, rice and cereals, nuts, milk and milk product, caterpillars. So here, we are going just to tick. So the first one is vegetable. Can we get vitamins in vegetable? Of course. Of course, we can tick. Yes, fruits. Also, meats. Fish. Yes. Rice. Let's say all we eat, we get vitamins. Depends. It depends on the amount of vitamins we can get, but vitamins, it's okay. But when we come here, after vitamins, we have minerals, protein, energy, and water. What can we get now in terms of minerals with vegetable? I think with vegetable, we can get the same. Yes, it is the same. We can get minerals with uh, vegetable. Fruits, can we get minerals? Of course, we have minerals. Meat, yes, of course. The next one is fish, is fish, of course. Rice and cereals, minerals, we get minerals, no problems. The next one will be uh, the nuts. According to our survey, it's okay. With nuts, we got minerals. And uh, milk product, it is the same. We found it here, it's the same. But coming here, it depends on the proportion of protein we can get. What kind of protein we can get? The most important protein we can get here with those food, we can get many protein in meat. With meat, we get a lot of protein. We tick. Fish. We also have a lot of protein in fish. After this one, after protein, we have energy. What kind of energy? What kind of energy? So the energy we have here, oh, in 
vegetable, fruit, meat, fish, rice, and cereal, nuts, milk product, milk and milk product in the caterpillar, we have energy. They produce energy. All of them. All of them. They produce energy. What we eat produce energy. Why they produce energy? Because when we eat, it is transformed. It is the nutrient. It is transformed in carbohydrate. The carbohydrate is like the gasoline for the car. Without the gasoline, the car cannot run. So this one, it is like our fuel. It is the fuel for our body. That's why we eat every day to get fuel, to get energy. So everything we eat here, that's why we have ticked, because they produce energy. So the last one is water. What is water? Well, we can get a lot of water here. So in water, we have the fruits. We have a lot of water in fruits. Yes, we can tick. And we have in milk product. The milk product, milk itself, and its products like cheese and so on, it contains, the milk contains a lot of water. So, uh, this one was the third activity. So I think here is the result. Here is the correction. So the next one, as we have started with the activity one, two, to the activity three, the activity four, the last one, will be the exercise. I will know, I, wanted to, I want to know whether what we have studied, you have, underst you have understood it. So concerning the, concerning the evaluation, it is here. Excuse me, here, so you have these words match the English word with its French English words. You have lamb, sheep, kid, sow, calf, pig meat, rabbit, crab, crayfish, cow, hill, beans. So you have also here, you have to match with this side. This side, this one, it is in French. You have une langouste, haricot, une anguille, une morue, un crabe, un lapin, viande de porc, un veau, une truie, un chevreau, un mouton, un agneau. It's up to you to match, to match this word from the English one to the French one. So this one, if it is the baccalaureate, you don't need to lose all your time. To save the time, you can go directly because you have some letters here from A to L. So what you should do, you can just write one and give the answer. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and the last one is twelve. Twelve. To save time, you can go directly. One, you give the answer corresponding to the letter. Two, you give the letter that corresponds to two, and so on. So here, according to you, what is the answer? Number one. The lamb one is lamb. Lamb is correspond to which letter? It corresponds to which letter? It's up to you to give the answer. It is up to you. So the first one. So the first one, one, it is agneau. So it corresponds to the letter L. Number two, the number two here, it is sheep. What is a sheep? Sheep. So in French, you have langouste and so on. Look, look, look. Oh, yes, we have K, mouton. It is mouton. Mouton, it is K, letter K. The third one, the third one is kid. What is kid? Sometimes you, you, you're used to, to hear the word kid, but this kid is different, not a person. What is kid? According to you, it corresponds to which letter? Kid. Kid. The kid corresponds 
to the letter, which letter? And she wrote. It is the letter G. The next one is four. It is so. The so. Here you have already. We have took this one. Already. Mutton. Already. Chevro. Already. What is this one? The so. Correspond to which letter? According to you, it will be the letter I. Letter I. Number five. Calf. 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 The I is three. In three. What about the letter five? It is calf. Calf corresponds to which letter? To the letter H, which is vo. H. This is to save the time, to go quickly. Time saving. Number six, pig meat. This one is easy for you, according to me. Pig. Pig meat. What is pig meat? It is J. Viande de porc. Viande de porc. Number eight. Number seven. Seven, excuse me. Excuse me. It was number seven. This was six. Number seven. The seven is rabbit. 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 Already, this one already, it is un lapin. F. Un lapin. The next one is eight. Eight is crab. Crab is like, it sounds, it sounds like in French, crab. It is un cab. The letter is E. Number nine, crayfish. What is a crayfish? Crayfish. It is number nine. The number one crayfish is A. Une langouste. Une langouste. Number ten. The number ten is a card. Card. Already, this already taken. The number 10, number 10 here, it is what? 10 is card. What is a card? Card is the letter D. D. Letter D is card. Card is a big fish. We find it in the ocean. It's a very big fish. It's good. It has a lot of protein when you eat it. A lot of vitamins. Uh, now we come to we come to the next one. It is ill. The ill here it corresponds to which letter? It is number eleven. Eleven. It is une anguille. C. C. At last, this is the last one. Bin. What is the bin? So it is clear. You already have the answer. It is the last words. Because we have already taken moru. So it is arico. It is the letter B. So from this one, you have the answer. You have the answers. No need to come back. It's quite easy. Now we are going to move to the second one. It will be the lesson about health. It will be the lesson about health. So, let's clean the blackboard.
Now we'll go, now we'll move to the, the chapter two. It is an approach to the concept of health. And uh, we'll start with the activity one. We are going to choose the correct definition. Let me give it here, the A. Definition, health is health is is a it is the condition of the body condition of the body b the good condition of the body the good condition the good condition of the body of the body the last one the last one is c c says the fair condition the fair condition the fair condition of the body of the body. <clears throat> so this is the first activity you are going to choose. The next one will be the activity two. Activity two, this is the first one. Activity two, activity two. The activity two, what is it about? Among the following elements, which one are responsible for the diseases among, among the following, the following element, following elements, which ones, which ones, which ones are responsible, are responsible are responsible for the disease, for the diseases, sorry, for the diseases, for the diseases, question mark. So you have it, insect. Let's quote them, insect, plural, yes, microbes. Snakes, snakes, sorry, snakes, snakes, yes, snakes, viruses, the viruses, fungi, fungi, we have bacteria, 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 alcohol, 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 kingdom, kingdom, antibodies, 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 crocodiles, cro -co -cro -co -dals, cro -co -dals, crocodiles, 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 crocodiles and bacillus, bacillus. Write them, write them here, them here. We are going to write them here. And um, to write them here, and uh, after it will be the activity three, the activity three will be about activity, activity three. It will be about finding the disease they can cause. Finding, finding the diseases, the diseases, diseases they can cause. They 
can cause. So here we have a grid they can uh, cause. So what we are going to do just to tick, it is said to tick, tick in the box, tick in the box, tick in the box corresponding, corresponding, corresponding to the diseases, to the disease or diseases, depends. Each element can cause, each, each element, each element can cause, can cause, full stop. So we have a grid like this one. Let me draw. Let me draw grid like this one. Okay. So the first one, column, is column like this. How much? Here we have element and here another one, one, two. Yes, like this, like this, we have the first one here, one, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 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 I'm not sure, let me add here, I'll add another one here, with this grid, so we have all these elements, we are going to work here, at the end, but let's come back to the concept. I see the two, it was an approach to the concept of health. Here, the activity one, it is said, choose the correct definition, <coughs> health is. So you have three proposals, it's up to you to choose. The first one, A, the condition of the body, B, the good condition of the body, C, the fair condition of the body. What is the correct answer? So here, the correct answer, it is the B. It is the good condition of the body. So health is the good condition of the body. So let's come down to the activity two. It is said among the following element, which ones are the responsible for the diseases? You have insect. Microbes, snakes, viruses, fungi, bacteria, alcohol, condom, antibodies, crocodiles, bacillus. You have to write them here. So, the first one, we have insect that causes, cause, it causes the insect. Which insect causes malaria? I think, excuse me, the insect causes the disease the insect can cause, as we say, the mosquito, it is malaria. So we take insect. The next one, it is microbes. They also cause, they cause the diseases. The next one, we have viruses. Viruses, coma, fungi. After fungi, what else? We have also bacteria. Bacteria causes diseases. The last one here, it is bacillus. Okay, from this activity, it will lead us to the activity tree it is just the following of this activity. So in activity three, it is said, it is said finding the diseases they can cause. What you should do is to tick, tick in a box corresponding to the diseases. It can be disease or diseases. Each element can cause. Here we have the element. The element we have microbes, insect, bacillus, viruses. And here we have the diseases, AIDS, 
leprosis, tuberculosis, cirrhosis, diarrhea, Ebola, corona, malaria, and STDs. The STDs here stands for sexual transmissive diseases. Okay, here you have just to tick. The microbes. When we see microbes, we start with microbes. We can say diarrhea, microbe. We tick here. The second element, we have the insect. The insect here that causes diseases, which kind of diseases? It is malaria. Malaria. We tick malaria. When we come down, the bacillus, we have the leprosis. It is caused by uh, it is caused by a bacillus, leprosis. We have also tuberculosis. It is caused by a bacillus. Good. The last element here we have viruses. The first. When we come here, we have AIDS. You know it very well that AIDS is caused by a virus. The next one we go here, we have leprosis, tuberculosis, cirrhosis. Yes, cirrhosis is also caused by a virus. And the next one, we have Ebola. Ebola, you know that it's a very dangerous virus. Ebola, also it's a virus. Virus, oh, Corona, you know, COVID-19, it's caused by a virus, of course, Corona. Corona, and the last, the last element we have here, we didn't tick, it is STDs. In STDs, we have here, we have microbes, we have insects, Bacillus, viruses. What can we take here? It is STDs that stand for sexual transmitted diseases. It's microbes. Microbes, we take here. Okay, dear learners, we come to the end of our activity. The last one will be the exercise. So, to evaluate what we have already studied, here is the evaluation. It's up to you to give the correct answers. So here, the activity two or three, it is match the English words with the French equivalent. Here we have the first one, to be in good health. The second one, to be in bad health. The third one, a checkup. The fourth one, it is to call in a doctor. Number five, a bout of fever. Number six, a stuffed nose. Number seven, an injury. Number eight, uh, to suffer from. Number nine, an F sand. And number 10, an emergency. You have the French one here. On your right, une urgence, être en bonne santé, souffrir de, bilan de santé, un nez bouché, Faire venir un docteur, un accès de fièvre, un centre médical, une blessure, être en mauvaise santé. Here, to save the time, as I used to tell you, what you should do to write just numbers, and you will give the letter. So you have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine, and ten. So it's up to you because you have A, B, C, D, E, F, J, H, I, and you have also the G. So here, number one, it corresponds to what? To be in good health. In French, it is B, être en bonne santé. Être en bonne santé. Number two, to be in bad health. It is the G. Être en mauvaise santé. This is the answer. Number three, a checkup. What is a checkup? A checkup, a checkup in French, 
we go to D. It is bilan de santé. Number four, to call in a doctor. Call in a doctor. Here we have F. Faire venir un docteur. Faire venir un docteur. Number four. Number five, a bout of fever. Number five, what is it? Number five, what is number five? Let's read the French one. Here we have, uh, son de santé, accès, nez bouché, bilan de santé, souffrir, uh, ainsi de suite. Un accès de fièvre. It is the number, it is G. Number six, exercise number six, a snuff nose. Snuff nose, you have the nose, that means also nez. Nose, un nez bouché. Un nez bouché. The good answer is E. We go to the following, it is number seven. An injury, quasi, quasi, an injury. An injury here, what is it? Here. Une blessure. It is I. Une blessure. To suffer from. To suffer from, in French, uh, to suffer from, souffrir de. The letter is C. And as easy as you can see, number 10, it is an emergency. An emergency? The last answer is the letter A, which is une urgence. Une urgence. Okay, this is the best answer. It was a pleasure. And um, thanks for watching. And see you next time. Thank you very much.